Hello, mom. Yes, I've arrived at Navy boot camp. I've arrived safely. You will be receiving a letter from me in a couple weeks, very shortly. Mom, petty officers looking at me. I have to go. I love you. Bye. Yeah, I'm pull up to the spot. This shit way too fucking lit. Members only in my gang. What's our queens? All right, so let's talk about that first phone call you're going to get in boot camp. Uh, so your very first phone call that you're going to get in boot camp is in the very first day, whenever you first arrive. Like, as soon as you get off the bus, you're going to go in to... Uh, what is it called? Uh, Freedom Freedom Hall? No, it's not Freedom Hall. It's it's some kind of Navy building. It's, it's in processing. And you're going to go in there and you're going to form up in the, these long lines, right? And there's going to be flags on the floor, right? When you walk in there, don't step on a single flag. Also, don't look at the RDCs in their eyes. Just stand at attention, face your eyes forward, hands to your side, and the ball like this, right? Just pointing. Touch your whole hand to your side on the seam of your pants. Don't look at anybody. Just keep your eyes down and then just listen to what they have to say. Then they're going to give you an opportunity to call. And then uh, at the beginning of this video, I did an example of the phone call. That is that is the only time you're going to get to talk to your parents in like two weeks. Then you go to the ship. You do P-Days for about a week. And then you'll get to your new ship and... You get to go through it and you have to wait one more week. Then you get another phone call around that time. That's going to be your first phone call. When you get that first phone call in boot camp, it's going to be a little bit different. Uh, they're going to take you to a store called the called the Naval Exchange. And pretty much you'll be able to go buy a phone call right in there. Uh, if I were you, I would buy the $20 one. Uh, I know some people like to cheap out on the 10s, but the $20 one is going to make sure that you can make the entirety of your phone calls the entire time. Uh, then you're going to go into this big room of pay phones. Uh, you're going to get the call. Uh, sometimes some of the phones are a little static -y, So just tell your parents, they might not be able to hear you, um, as much. Uh, what helped was pushing the cord into the phone to try to get a little bit clearer audio, but some of the phones just don't really work that good. Uh, and you're going to have a phone call for about 10 minutes. You get to talk about that. And then you get one more like regular phone call. So I think in total you have like four or five phone calls, uh, four not counting the uh, the arrival phone call. So you'll get one uh, just in the two week period and then you'll get another one at your four week. And then I think right after battle stations you get a phone call and then right after OPFA. Uh, so you can let your parents know that you're gonna be graduating and doing all that stuff. Uh, so these phone calls, it depends on length, depending on your RDCs, how well your division has been doing, things like that. Uh, obviously the Navy does want you to be able to keep in contact with your family, the people supporting you. Uh, as much as your RDCs may treat it as like an inconvenience and stuff, uh, it's very important that you get to talk to your family. The Navy does care about that stuff. Um, but sometimes the RDCs will cut the phone call short to keep you guys focused instead of missing home because you're gonna miss home like crazier before especially after these phone calls um a lot of people in my division were tearing up uh crying uh funny story i actually didn't get to get my first phone call uh normal phone call for about a week uh after because i got my wisdom teeth pulled so i was siq and then uh the rdc's had to find time to make that phone call but eventually i did get to make it and if you ever miss a phone call they they are required to give you that phone call. You just might have to do it in the office and it might be slightly shorter. Uh, might be like 10 minutes instead of like 15 to 20, uh, depending on how well y'all do. But yeah, you guys do get phone calls, so I wouldn't even worry about that. Uh, also, in about two weeks uh, after you get there, you'll be able to start sending letters once you get to your actual ship. So don't trip about that, guys. Um, y'all stay focused when you go to boot camp. Get through it, because uh, whenever you get to A school, your life's going to be a lot better. You're going to start training for your job, which you sign on to do. And uh, then you'll get to the fleet. Quality of life goes up. I can't really tell you about the fleet yet because I haven't gotten there. But uh, just know uh, you guys got this. I believe in you guys. And uh, I think the Navy wants you to succeed. So they're going to do everything they can to make sure your boot camp process is. Uh, they give you the mandatory training, but you also get to. Keep in contact with people as best as you can. Anyway, guys, I hope you have a blessed day. Thank you for watching my video. If you do like what I have to say over here or you just want to know about boot camp or life in the Navy, just go ahead and hit a subscribe down below. Uh, I post like motivational videos. I try to 
just be as honest as I can with y'all, as transparent. Uh, tell you guys really the truth about my life in the Navy and, you know, what we go through and things like that. Um, if you guys are interested in, like, stocks and stuff, uh, I have a link down below to Robinhood, and then it'll get you a free stock. Uh, it helps me out because I also get a free stock for recommending you. So that's why you should use my link instead of just signing up on the App Store. Um, and I also got two buddy for uh, content creators. Maybe you want to join the Navy and start making YouTube videos about the Navy also. Uh, TubeBuddy helps with that. It helps uh, you come up with tags quicker so your videos get recommended, uh, give you tips for thumbnails, all that stuff. It's something I use every time I post a video. So y'all check that out if that's something that y'all are interested in. And if not, you know, I hope you have a blessed day. Good luck to you if you're going to boot camp. Um, comment the day that you're going. Uh, I would love to have a conversation with you guys. Anyway, uh, y'all stay blessed. Merry fucking Christmas. Peace.